This video should get around 50,000 views, maybe 75,000 views or 100. Because I have something here to show you, and I want everybody to see it. Uh, it's one of the first videos I ever did in this channel. It's really kind of cool, but uh, because it was so early on in the videos, not a lot of people saw it. So it's one of my really cool acrylic dragons. And uh, you're going to learn something if you want to learn something. If you don't, just watch for the entertainment value and uh, stick around. You ready to go? Now, when I said I wanted 50,000 to 75,000 views, I wasn't kidding. I really need to get this page going, and I need to get a lot more than 25 views. And I'm not trying to complain about YouTube, but you guys need to help me out here and get this, this video going. This video is so old, I can barely remember even painting it. It's back when I first started painting again two years ago, and I had to remember how to do it. Uh, it's kind of during my power slop um, era, where I just kind of threw paint up on the canvas, and then I drew my dragons in, and then I blocked the colors in, which I'm doing right here. I'm just blocking in with a medium gray. Uh, this is before I do my highlights and my shadows. So right now I'm just blocking. Oh, I think right now I'm putting my shadows in. So I kind of remembered the process. You block it in with a medium tone, you put in your shadows, and then you spend all your time putting your highlights in. I think this picture right here is hanging in my brother's house somewhere. Um, I actually like this one quite a bit. It turned out pretty good. Uh, the background may have been a tad bit busy. Uh, kind of has an abstract look to it, like they're, like they're inside of a cave or something. So I like that painting quite a bit. Double Dragons, that's what it's called. And then I come up on my next video uh, painting. This is a separate painting. Um, kind of the same power slop kind of a, a effect. I, I wetted the canvas down with just plain water after I gessoed it. Then I threw up some color and let it spread. And drew on my dragon and I'm blocking in my medium tones. And these aren't really medium tones. These are kind of more of a, of a 80% gray tone. But I will go in here and I, right here I am just uh, shading it all. Because you have, to, you have to knock it back before you can pull it back out again. So I'm, this is all uh, gray tones, gray tones, gray tones, and uh, then I put in my, my colors. And I, I made this one purple, so I did a wash, a purple wash over my gray tones. Um, and it didn't matter how I did it, I just needed to make sure I covered all the gray. I had all my values correct because I did the grays first with the shadows. Then I took some gray, some purple with some white and added some highlights. Uh, it's, it's a multi-layer pro layering process that I invented, and you can buy the process for me. I'll sell it to you. Here I am putting in the eyeball, and this is the finished painting. Uh, this is about two years old. I gave this one away as well.